in science. In this video, let's rewrite 1.5 as a fraction. So we have the number with a decimal 1.5. The first thing I would like to do is just place it over 1. Now what I would like to do is move the decimal to the far right. So I need to move it one place to the right. And we have 1s and 10s, so I can do that by multiplying numerator and denominator by 10. When I do that, that gives me um, 1.5 times 10 is 15, and 1 times 10 is 10. So now I need to reduce or simplify the fraction 15, 10. I can do that by finding a greatest common factor. And I'm going to use a factor tree. So the factors, prime factors for 15 is 5 and 3. And then for 10, you have 5 times 2, circle the prime numbers. And so now those are the prime numbers for 15 and 10. What I think is um, easiest thing to do is just create a little chart and write the prime numbers in the chart. The prime numbers of 15 are 5 and 3, and for 10 are 5 and 2. So now the rule is, is if you're finding the GCF, the greatest common factor, if you have a vertical pair, then you can bring down one number. And so we have a vertical pair here, but not here. So the greatest common factor is 5. So now let's go back to the number, the fraction we are reducing. And I'm going to divide 15 by 5 and 10 by 5. And that gives me 15 divided by 5 equals 3. 10 divided by 5 is 2. 3 halves. And if you would like, you can further convert that to an improper fraction. 2 goes into 3 one time with, excuse me, 2 yeah, goes into 3 one time with the remainder of 1. And I'll place that over the 2. So it's one and a half. So if you rewrite 1.5 as a fraction, you can write it as 3 over 2 or 1 and a half. I hope that helps. Thanks for watching, and Movie Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.